Well, I'm sitting here in our new home. Of course, as you can see, it's still empty and you can still hear the echo. Deb's adding a few things here and there to make it feel like home right now while we're waiting for our furniture, which is still sitting in California. We're finding out that this is really a nationwide issue and we're not the only ones that are involved in this, but other people are waiting for their furniture as well. Many people actually. But I started thinking about our home and when we were looking for a home, and I want to talk to you today about the home of your dreams on your morning cup of inspiration using the mug that was provided for us to say hello because mine is still in storage. But you know the home of your dreams is what we hear from these agents when we are looking for a home. And Deb and I we flew out here to Florida and we took a week to look from west coast to east coast just to look to see uh, what, what we would like and what would fit the parameters what we we're looking for. And we kept finding homes that they were nice, they were nice, and a little, a little nicer and a little nicer. And the, the last day, we, we found a home that we thought, okay, it's, it's a nice home, but it's, 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 it fits the parameters for now, but there's, there's things that are lacking and things that we liked about it that we weren't expecting. But the agent picked up on that and kept just pushing us, you know, this is the home of your dreams, don't let it go by, it's forever, your forever home. And I said, I didn't even bring a checkbook, I'm just, we're just looking at homes right now. And the agent said, just put it on a credit card. And go, yeah, we are not don't feel comfortable with that. So as we left, Deb and I were praying about it. And of course it wasn't the home we wanted. And, and another home that we thought we wanted, it, that fell through, it just wasn't right. And God provided us with this home, which has been perfect for us. It meets, it meets all our, our boxes, all the boxes check off on it, which has just been wonderful for us because we're in God's will and we let him guide us and directed us to it. We saw homes and checked off, which we didn't want. And we found the ones that God wanted us to have. And here we are. We're in our, our home, our new home. But you know, thinking about the home of your dreams, the home of your dreams should not be here on earth. It should be your forever home, which is in eternity. Hebrews 13, 14 tells us, For here we have no lasting city, but we seek uh, the city that is to come. And of course, that is the city that Christ said he's going to prepare a place for us. John 18, 36 says, Jesus answered, my kingdom is not of this world. If my kingdom were of this world, my servants would have been fighting that I might not be delivered over to the Jews, but my kingdom is not of this world. So I wanna go where Christ's kingdom is because that's the, the home I want, the home of my future, the home of my dreams, my forever home. In 1 Corinthians 2, 9, the Bible says, but as it is written, what no eye has seen, nor ear heard, nor the heart of man imagined, what God has prepared for those who love him. He is preparing a place for us and we're gonna love it because we're gonna be with him for eternity there. But in Revelation 21, 27, it also says, but nothing unclean will ever enter it, nor anyone who does what is detestable or false, but only those who are written in the Lamb's Book of Life. And how do we know we're written in the Lamb's Book of Life? By giving ourselves to the Lord, by asking for forgiveness, by repenting of our sins. Ask him into our life, having a personal relationship with him. Do you have that today? You can have your name written in the Lamb's Book of Life and have your forever home, your dream home, the home of your dreams for eternity with our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless everyone. I look forward to seeing you again for another Morning Cup of Inspiration. Have a wonderful day.